Hello, darlings. My name is Jaxi. I'm an artist, model, ASM artist, and Pilates queen. Today, we are going to be doing a Pilates arms routine. It's a little different for my channel, but if you like wellness, overall positive vibes, and just manifesting dream life, go ahead and follow me right now, subscribe, and let's get into it. I am using three pound weights for this. Honestly, that's going to be really heavy. I would recommend one pound, two pounds, even no weights if you are new to Pilates arm stuff. We're just going to begin by rolling out our shoulders, rolling out our neck just a bit. Can bring right ear to right shoulder, do some neck rolls. Exactly. By the way, these shorts are from the underbelly, so check them out. Really cute yoga stuff. All right. All right, so let's just begin by doing some easy lifts. We're gonna go in right angles, as you can see, like this. We're just gonna do that for another six. Another three on either side, two, and one. Very good. Let's bring it up and just hold here, and then we can flip our wrists just like that. Keep that core tucked and engaged. Kind of tuck in the pelvis area to just keep that core nice and tight. Two more. Don't forget to breathe. And now let's hug the moon just like that. Halfway there. My arms are already burning, but the burn is good. We're training our brain to make that feel really good. Okay. Last one, and we're going to transition to hug a tree. Keep breathing, do not forget to breathe. Breath is your life force in Pilates. It allows you to kind of push. So the louder the breath, the better. Do two more. You got it. All right, hold if you can here, and we're just going to twist in our waist. All right, ready? Inhale. On the exhale, twist. Inhale, other way. Twist. We want to keep our hips facing forward. And just allowing that twist to come from the waistline. This is going to give us that adorable Pilates waist cinch girl. Also, if you have any lower back pain, Pilates is great for that as well. All right, let's go out one more time. Twist, twist, and hold. And now let's come down for a moment. Ooh, I feel it. I really feel it. All right, so now let's get into our serving. We have our hands like this, and we're just going to serve a tray. This is gonna feel a little harder because of the work that we just did. Exactly, exactly, but I love toned arms, just feeling strong. Pilates is so fun. If you haven't gotten into it, my favorite is just Matt Pilates. I've been doing it for about six years, I'd say. Okay. But 
I'm not technically an instructor because I haven't paid for that yet. Okay, arms out. We're just going to fold in, do a bicep curl. Exactly, try to keep your elbows up if you can. Like I said, three pounds is very heavy for this. Not gonna lie. Kind of forgetting to keep count here, but as much as, as just let it go until it burns, sort of the rule. Okay, all right, let's do one more. Okay, now turn out and oof, go up. Don't forget to breathe, breathe through it. You could fully do this without any dumbbells and I'm sure it would still burn, okay? Keep that core tucked. I mean that pelvis. Let's do five more. Five, four, three, two, one. It also helps to smile, hold, and lower down. Okay, very good. Right away, let's put two dumbbells in one hand. We're gonna start rocking, rocking a baby, rocking a baby. Try to keep your neck and shoulders down and relaxed here. Very good guys, you're killing it. You are absolutely killing it. Okay. Three more. And switch to the other side. I love Pilates arms routines because they just, they're such a good workout, but they're not grueling. I don't know if there's something fun about them. Three, two, one. All right, let's take it another hand, just one. We're going to go from one shoulder to the other, kind of hit that elbow out. Three, two, one. On the next one, we're gonna go up like that. Just for eight here. Keep breathing. Yes, it's gonna burn. Two more. And bring it down. Oh, shake it out, shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. All right, let's do the other side. Need to make sure that we are even. I can't remember how many we did the other side, but it's okay. So I was kind of speeding up there. We'll try to make these slow and intentional. Our body likes to speed up when we're uncomfortable. And again, training our brain. Yes, we can, we got this. You are fantastic. You are so beautiful and so strong. I'm so proud of you. All right, now let's go up. <sighs> Try to keep that at a 90 degree angle. You can also hold your elbow if that helps. Sorry. Okay. Four, three, two, one. Oh, shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Now grabbing both your um, dumbbells. Let's do a forward fold. Let those arms hang. Oh, I don't wanna flash anybody. Okay. And let them go in a little circle, little pendulums. Very good. The hard work is over now. Drop those weights. Let's do a quick stretch. Take oof, one arm over and make sure not to um, go on the elbow, but what we can do here or over here. Breathe in. Very 
good. Let's go to the other side. Great. Now take one arm back and push your head back. Allow that stretch. Feels good. Other side. Press that head back. Very good. All right. Remember to drink water, allow your muscles to rest, and feel free to come back tomorrow and do this video again or later today, whatever you feel. Have a beautiful, beautiful day and check out my other movement videos in the playlist below. Love you guys.